Thanks for joining us on the Open African Television Afric Media. We're live here in Rabat, Morocco, on the relaunch of the African Atlantic Initiative happening here today, the 8th of June. And the Open African Television has the opportunity here to welcome with us here the uh, Gambian Minister of Foreign Affairs and the person of uh, His Excellency Tangara Mamadou. Thanks for joining us on Afric Media. You're welcome. 13 years after the foundation of this initiative was launched, we have the opportunity and the privilege today this initiative has been relaunched. What's your appreciation and what role will Gambia be playing on this very important Pan-African organization? Well, it's uh, an excellent initiative and today more than ever before we need such an organization because we've seen uh, recently some unfortunate development in the countries bordering the Atlantic Ocean. For a very long time, piracy issue, for example, was a far distant thing, but now it's getting closer to home. So it's important that rather than engaging in firefighting diplomacy, we take initiatives to see how, do, how we can uh, rise up to the challenge. And that's what we are doing here in Rabat. So what is exactly the role that your country will play in Gambia? It's uh, one of the countries, of course, just like you mentioned, that uh, we have the aspects of uh, a lot of security challenges now, how will your country benefit? Well, if you've listened carefully to the minister, we were talking about the spirit, the identity, not even, we are not talking about countries bordering outside the Atlantic where we look at uh, the geography, but we are talking about an identity. And the issues are issues that affects all of us. And I mentioned it during my intervention, these are issues that once one country is affected, we are all affected. And uh, COVID-19 uh, has served as a root awakening to our collective slumber because we thought that we have our countries separated, but we've realized that our destinies are interrelated, interlinked. So there is need for us to put together our resources, resources and fight uh, some of the wor worrisome development that we are having in the, our region. Now, this is equally coming at a time when the African continent is facing a lot of pressure from the West. Do you think this will be able to stand firm to protect the interests of these countries belonging to the organization? Well, the, 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 the objective is to pull our resources together, close our ranks, work together, speak with one voice. Well, because our partners are doing the same thing, there is no reason why we should not be doing. And I think if you look at the situation in the world with the rippling effects of the Ukraine war, now is the time to make sure that we work closely together. God forbid, if there is a major crisis in maritime, maritime transport, you, can you imagine the consequences on Africa? So it's important that as countries share in the Atlantic Ocean that we work like one family. Many are afraid about the sustainability of this organization, considering that the foundation stone was laid since 2009. Now, what's the message and what do you tell those who are in this organization? And well, if you listen to uh, my colleague from Nigeria, he talked about ownership, having local chapters. I think that's a way to deal with this kind of situation. And what we want to avoid is to have a huge bureaucratic machine that will be unproductive where you will have a lot of tedious and cumbersome procedures that you will not understand. But this is our problem, this is our issue, and we need to take, to take ownership and make sure that we uh, deal with it and uh, solve it once and for all by taking the bull by the horns. Thank you very much, Your Excellency Tangara Mamadou, for talking to Africa Media. My pleasure. And we're still here in the Rabat. Morocco. Stay with us in your Pan African television as we continue to bring to you more during this event the launch, relaunch of the African Atlantic uh, Organization. Stay with us. <laughs>